All right, guys, Gemini, back with another video. And in this video today, I'm going to be discussing WrestleMania 29 and why I absolutely hated this. <laughs> I hated this WrestleMania. I was not a fan of this WrestleMania at all. I was. I remember watching WrestleMania 29 with the exception of like two or three matches, just uh, being bored to death and just not into it at all. Other than a few matches, um, Punk and Taker. I love that match. I loved everything about it. I thought Punk really had a shot at the streak. Love that match. And I love the match with the Shield. I thought that that was really good too. But what really gets me hot about the main event of WrestleMania 29 at MetLife Stadium was The Rock and Cena. And the reason why I... First off, before we get to Rock and Cena, um, if you guys remember... Uh, this was not at Madison Square Garden. It was at MetLife. And that kind of pissed me off too because WrestleMania 1 was at MSG. WrestleMania 10 was at MSG. WrestleMania 20 was at MSG. I felt like they should have gone back to MSG for WrestleMania 29. I wanted it at Madison Square Garden. That's just the traditionalist in me. I know they go to big domes now, big stadiums. I wanted it at MSG. I wanted 29 at MSG. I thought every 10 years... You know, they should have gone back, even though it might have been nine years. You know, they should have gone back. I felt like it should have been MSG, even though, you know, they sold the whole place out, and it was crazy, and they made a ton of cash. That moment right there with The Rock and Cena holding each other's arms up really made me mad because I, I remember watching this. I wanted Cena to turn heel so bad on The Rock and just take that belt and just bash The Rock right in the head with it. I did. I wanted him to just take the belt and just... Ram the rock right in the head with the belt. And I was so disappointed with that's how they ended the show. And uh, here's my beef. WrestleMania 28. Rock and Cena. Once in a lifetime. Once in a lifetime. Once in a lifetime. One year later. Same two wrestlers back in the same match. Doing the same thing one year later. WWE doesn't even mention it. That they're actually doing this twice in a lifetime i feel like it was a scam i feel like we were cheated uh, whether cena won the royal rumble or not and the rock happened to be the champion at the time this was so set up to have these guys do twice in a lifetime and i wanted it i i feel to keep the integrity rock and cena at 28 should have been once in a lifetime and they should have kept that going there's nowhere on here do you see twice in a lifetime because wwe conveniently uh forgets to mention this is the second time they made a event at a WrestleMania. It's twice in a lifetime. But where? Where's the wording that says twice in a lifetime? Nowhere on here says twice in a lifetime. At the show of shows, John Cena has one chance to redeem himself from the loss that had been tormenting him for a year when he challenges. Fucking tormenting him. Tormenting the man. He's not tormented. He has $30 million in the bank. Is Nikki Bella at home. He lives in a huge ass house with the pool and fountains and and uh he lost a match and he's tormented from it i mean they played it where that match supposedly that match when he lost at 28 ruined his life and blah 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 and it caused him a divorce dude cena that's not why it caused you a divorce as much as i love you we know why your divorce was caused so you, you played with a porn star dude on the road I mean, as much as I love John Cena, that's what happened. He played with a porn star and he got caught. That's why his wife left his ass. As much as I love Cena and he's a hero to me, but dude, you, you, if you don't want to be silly, you got to cage your willy, man. You got caught. It wasn't The Rock's match at 28. Anyways, I could go on all day about 21. I thought most of the matches were boring. I disliked most of the matches. I was just bored. I wanted more. I wanted an MSG. Uh, at least have the decency not to insult the wrestling fans' intelligence and just call it twice in a lifetime. Um, I don't know, guys. You guys leave me your thoughts on 29, twice in a lifetime. Thanks for watching. I'm Gemini. Have a good one.